It once took four people to rescue me after I got stuck in a baby's cot. <laughs> Please, team. Um, right. What, first of all, how old were you? Uh, I was a grown-up. Why were you in a cot? Well, because I was trying it out, just to see how it felt. Did you not have a cot when you were a baby? I did, <laughs> but I couldn't remember what that felt like. So, oh, was, yeah. it, was it in someone's house? Wait a second. <laughs> no, it was in a cot shop. Showroom, showroom. Yes, oh. it was in a show. Thank you. Were you thinking of having a, a child? I was, very, I was pregnant. Are you very pregnant? I was at the pregnant. Time? Oh. Ah. And I, so I was there, and I thought I can't buy a cot without trying it. Of like you know, you need a test drive of beds. You know, do I'm I glad mean... you weren't buying a potty. <laughs> <laughs> How did you get in the cot if you were so heavily pregnant? Yes, good, excellent. <laughs> You know, bars yeah. on the side of the cot, and I sort of just wheeled myself in, and then it was embarrassing. Wheeled front, yourself front, in. Front, frontwards. frontwards, yeah, so like a dive, like a swallow dive. But those, Even though those it... things usually come down, don't they, at the side a bit? You can sort of oh, shush, move that, them down. That's a bit. what I did. What I did. Oh, wow. <laughs> On the side of the cot, I don't know whether you're aware, they have a little schnooky... I'm aware, because I just told you. Yes. <laughs> Good. And I just got it down and I got in the cot just to see how it would feel. Is and it then comfy? did you put the bars back up again? I don't... I, this, I can't remember... You yes, must have done, I otherwise did. you wouldn't have been stuck. <laughs> I did. I put the... Exactly. Was it? <laughs> it's like you were there. And then how, how did you get out then? Did somebody help you? They, the people had to help me. Four in the, people. In the cot in Port... Exactly. Who were these people? people? Well, they were just the people who worked in the... What? in John Lewis. Four people's a lot. Or maybe mm. it's just a good mm. service at John Lewis. It is a good shot. <laughs> um, I think they you've got two have. fragile things. You have, uh, you don't want to hurt the woman who's pregnant. Cost. Yes. And maybe mentally ill. And then... <laughs> <laughs> And, um, and then you have the other side of it, which is you've got um, a product Cot that's on sale. display. Cot for sale. Yeah, it's for sale. You don't want it to be. Kind of you don't want it to be. Let's not forget the unborn baby. And, and the tiny baby. <laughs> so, what do you think, Lee? Mm, what do you think, Steve? Truth or lie? I've got a feeling it's true. If you'd have been stuck in a cot, how many people would have come and helped you? Uh, uh, well, it would have been length problems more than anything else. It, it would have been, it would have been an odd shaped cot that you could fit uh, in. Coffin. Only head would have been. Coffin? <laughs> Would you in a coffin shop? Would you try that out to see? Because <laughs> you know, you're in that a lot longer, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> so what are you going to say? I'm going to say it's true. All right, Claudia, truth or lie? It is true. <laughs>